Hey guys, what's up? Uh, Random Poop123 here from Tech It R Us. Um, and today we're going to be doing the second episode of the new Technic LP series. And last time we finished off um, with uh, making this much progress on this amazing dome that we're making based off of Redstone Nightmares uh, dome himself. So let's go up there and get working on finishing it. So what we need to do is like that and like that. And last episode when I um, took off time to go get more of the dome done, it it took me a couple hours just to get this much progress. It's pretty crazy um, to complete. Now we can do that also. Forgot to do that. I think it's looking real nice. So we need to go up. There we go. And our plan is to make a nice looking dome. And so far, it's looking really nice. Even on the map, I think it looks really cool. Almost done. Just one more side on that. As you can see, this takes a long time just to get the simplest tax tasks done. And sorry for any lag. I am uploading episode one right at this moment. Like, once I was done recording and editing uh, episode one, I literally um, started rendering it right away. Not uploading, but rendering. Did I say uploading? I think I did. And let's go check um, Red Star Nightmares World. I want to see how he did the corners for his crafting roof, I should say. So he met to about there. Okay, they're all flat, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. I see, okay. Cool. Very, very cool. I think I'm going to do mine just a little bit differently. <laughs> I think it's looking real nice. Uh, okay, I already got... All that. Okay, guys, I'll be right back once I figure out what I want to do, and I'm probably going to get started on it just to show you. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. And uh, kind of felt like, oh, I actually erased some of it. I didn't want to accelerate any higher because I wanted enough room up here for me to do my... Um, crafting roof or automatic crafting roof to get set up for my logistics pipes. And I need to go make more automatic crafting tables. Not too hard. I think this side I made the stairs on. Whatever. Oh, I made them right there. Yeah, I think on the map it looks quite amazing. Go ahead and do that. There we go. And there we go.
Might need to grab more wood, but that is fine. I'm gonna make some or 64 automatic crafting tables. And I'm almost out of wood. I had uh, I think over 11 stacks of wood at the very beginning of this dome, which is quite amazing how much I went through. <coughs> okay. So let's do that. I think I'm getting some lag. Done with that triangle. Looking good. I'm not going to have it ridiculous to where I have as many crafting recipes as Redstone Nightmare had. He had every single item from Red Power 2. And and this version, I should say. In his um, crafting system. Same with IC2. He had all of them. It was pretty... Darn ridiculous. Oop. I might lose all my wood just making more of these crafting tables. Just gonna do that just to be safe. Oh, misplaced it. And I need to go make more. Not too many more though. Let's just get. I'm gonna get a stack and a half of wood. I think I got just enough. Just saying. Yep, I got just enough. I need to just craft it all. Sweet. We're almost done, guys. Much better. Okay. That looks really cool. I think we're done, guys. All we need to do is destroy those three blocks and kill a bunch of snakes. Come at me, bro. <clears throat> and maybe add some light. Okay, let's go. We are now done with... Uh, Doing that. Very happy about that. I'm gonna find the center block. Again, thought it'd be bigger, but that is fine. Now I'm gonna make the floor. Um, how do I want to do that? Cobble on the side. Yeah, I'm gonna do that way. 
Now I know what I want to do for the floor. That's going to look pretty cool. Maybe some more actually. Do I have any more? Yeah, I'll some sandstone in there. What about in here? Yep. Sweet. <clears throat> Anything else? Let's go to bed. Realize that we needed obsidian. Um, so yeah, I went ahead and got a ton of it actually. So yeah. So let's get started on the floor. So, we're going to need to clear out um, five. This is going to take a lot of digging, so just have patience. There we go. Hopefully we can start it with stuff other than um, actual building the actual uh, house. There we go. Looking good. We can let's get all this. And almost done with this rope. <laughs> uh cobble. Right here. Bam bam. Oh actually just right there. Let's go ahead and get that done. Sandstone time. Not too hard. I think it turned out really well. Again, we are basing this house off of Redstone Nightmare. So, yeah. So it will look pretty darn similar to his house. Just a little bit smaller and little things vary. So let's just get the cobblestone pad set out for right now. And I will try to have um, a little liquid, uh, I guess you could say, supply area in one of the corners and like a maybe Thongcraft in one corner, Cloven Exchange in another. Oh, well, not a color change, but maybe something else. Almost done with these. I wish I... One thing I do regret, I wish I made it bigger. It is definitely not big enough. Yes, I know, that's what she said. Ha ha ha. <clears throat> and I want to try to make one corner for thermal expansion. I'm kind of new to that mod, but I think it looks really cool. Okay, and let's vary, it, or not vary, but change it up here. Um, 
There we go. Looking good. Now this ends here. Or it should at least. <clears throat> Actually, I'm going to change that. There. It ends there. Hmm. Let's go ahead and get all that cleared out on every single one. Three, four, five. There we go. There we go. Just like so. Okay. Now we can place our sandstone in there. <coughs> there we go. Looking good. Um, now let's finish up the sandstone on the sides. And then I'll show you why I needed all this obsidian. So let's go ahead and do all this. I was just going to make a direwolf 9x9, but I wanted to change it up. Why am I putting obsidian? I'll be right back once I got all that mined and all the sand cleared out and sandstone put in. So yeah. Okay guys, I'm back. Um, went ahead and finished up the sandstone cobblestone part and um, cleared out the sand here for what I'm going to be doing. And I realized I'm going to need a lot more obsidian. So I went ahead and got myself a ton more. And I mean a ton. It took me probably an hour just of mining the actual obsidian. And about 30 minutes of finding it. So this episode has probably taken me at least two to three hours just to do all this. Ridiculoso. And I have placed an obsidian in the incorrect place. Okay, when I do that, when I move my uh, cursor off of the obsidian and it has to restart. Let's be careful on the placing atom. Sweet. Let's just do the outline. Let's go ahead and do that on the others. <coughs> there we go, get the outline of that one, and let's get the outline of this one. And I miscorrect incorrectly placed this block. I put I said miscorrect. <laughs> We do have a pretty cool uh, sand mountain right behind our house along with a lava pit over there. And lava pit could be used for geothermal generation. Who knows? I wonder why on the map it says... It looks like there's little clear spaces. I don't know how to explain that. Maybe the sun's shining in those um, windows, I should say. Okay, got the outline. Looking good, sweet. Uh, once I finish up placing all this obsidian, I will see how long this episode has been going on and uh, see whether I should end it or continue on and settling in.
<clears throat> Looking good. Oh, one more. Man, I thought I was done. Looking good, sweet. I need to light up this house. Let's go get some torches. Or some coal, I should say. Oh, 64. That'll do. Just for right now. Not too difficult. And you're probably wondering, you're placing them randomly, but nope, I'm actually spacing them out to a part. I'm just timing my clicks. Sweet. And I also want to do this. Um, maybe... <sighs> Let me decide how I want to do this. Yeah, that's good. There should be five total. One, two, three, four, and I need more torches. Sweet. Okay, now I have a lit up dome. Actually, I'm going to have to light up the um, inner part of the room. I'm going to go do that. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. I'm done placing the torches on the inside. Now, I think it looks pretty freaking awesome. Um, so, yeah, I forgot to check the time. Uh... I guess what I could no no you know what guys I'm pretty sure it's been about 30 minutes so I'm gonna end the episode here this has been the uh, second episode of my Technic LP I hope you guys join me next time we'll get settled into the house hopefully get an IC2 setup going um, so yeah I'll see you guys later <laughs>